Hi, I'm Jonathan J. Ryan. I'm from Wargaming Recon, and we're here at the Amherst Maker's Fear Game Day. And I'm with Timothy Colonna from Trilaterum. Timothy, how are you? Hi, how are you doing? So, do you want to talk to us a little bit about what Trilaterum is? I know listeners of our podcast have heard you before, but for our video viewers, this is probably new. Sure. Uh, so, Trilaterum is a 15 millimeter sci fi miniatures game um, set well into the future. Um, it's uh, based on um, uh, a set of rules that I wrote um, where each stand uh, represents a unit of men. So, so each small stand will be uh, a squad of guys out there um, fighting on, on the distant frontiers of space. Cool. Um, it uh, was developed about five years ago and we're on our second printing. Um, we've just released a starter set as well as a new book um, as well as a full line of 3d printed miniatures terrain and everything you need to play the game um, it's uh, it's a fun little game um, not a not a um, large price point to get into playing um, it's available on our website www.trilateral.com as well as any of your local gaming shows I'm usually at um, <laughs> you are r running games and um, see you everywhere. selling things so um, we're we're um, we're very excited to be able to get out into at least into the makerspace um, this is a new venue for us mm -hmm. um, it's been nice to see all the people coming in and um, especially being a makerspace and we're 3d printed of course. It's, uh, it was just a good wow. fit for us there's so many kids here today which is really cool I saw a bunch of kids playing or looking at your stuff at one of the tables over here yes they just I think kids are drawn to this kind of um, atmosphere yes so like you have a game like this out and they're really into it so for people who want to get their offspring into gaming you're a gaming dad Yes, this is kind of a cool way to do it. Yes, it, it definitely. I, I, uh, the rules are very um, fun and easy to learn, so they're great for um, uh, families as well as um, the the gaming dad trying to teach their get their kid into playing uh, games. It's a good jumping off point. Usually, when I when I run the games at, at the conventions and that sort of thing, usually by turn two, it's on autopilot and they've learned the rules and they're they're kind of going on their own. And I'm just there to to point and say, okay, roll the roll for that, or you need to move that unit. So um, it's pretty fairly straightforward to learn, and people have fun with it. And your 3D products look amazing. Thank you. They're really nice. And um, Adrian, our camera guy, has bought some of your historical stuff that you have <laughs> as well, and just everything looks really good. Thank you. Uh, I'm impressed by it all. Thank I know you. nothing about 3D printing. It kind of intimidates me, uh, but I'm just I'm amazed at what you've done. Thank you. I spent a lot of time tuning my printers and um, making sure that the quality is high enough for something that I would want to buy, mm -hmm. um, so that when I'm selling the product to the customer, that they get a good quality product that um, they'll be happy with. And you have a new product, right, that you're kind of testing out right now? Yes. So we are. Um, my graphic designer has. Um, come up with a, um, uh, a gaming map for us, which is a, a space world. It's a, kind of blues and purple tones, and it's kind of meant to be a moon or something like that. Do you want to show that? Sure, sure. Sir, can I? So this is a new product that we're working with. It's a four by six gaming map, um, which is going to be available on our website. Um, and it's uh, uh, kind of a space world, something like that. Um, got the Trilateral logo on it right here. So people can know that they're using a Trilateral uh, map. Um, and these will be hitting the website. Um, we're, we're looking at a price point of around $60 for the 4x6 mat. It's a fleece um, printed. It's very nice. It's so soft, which I know doesn't matter for most people, but I love that it's soft. <laughs> well, thank you. I appreciate that. Uh, no, it's a beautiful thing, and I think people should check it out. And Great. I love the design. Thank you. Thank you. For, yeah, we wanted something that was unique that people haven't really seen before, mm -hmm. um, especially being a sci-fi miniatures game. Um, you're going to be battling on all kinds of different worlds, so they're not all green. So uh, we wanted to kind of showcase that, at least with our first map. Um, no, that's true. So, so if people want to buy your products and stay up to date with it, what's the best way for them to do that? Uh, so we're on Facebook, www.facebook.com slash Trilaterum. We also have a website, www.trilaterum.com. Um, and all of our products are available on there and that's the best place to stay in touch with us. That's awesome, and as everyone knows, you can stay up to date with us on all the things as Wargaming Recon or WargamingRecon.com. Thank you so much, Timothy. It's been Thank a pleasure. You. Thank you, Jonathan. Thank you.